Hello, my friends. We've come to Sing Shuiyan Mountain, or Clean Water Peak. The famous Buddhist temple Sing Shuiyan is located here. This is one of the most famous tourist attractions in Angshi province. We're visiting our friend. He's a farmer, and we're tasting different Tie Guan Yin teas made this autumn. And I'd like to say a couple of words about the differences in wet leaves after brewing. After brewing, the tea leaves open, and you can easily see the differences. These days, two kinds of tea are the most common. The first is King Zhan, a hand-picked tea. Picking is always done by hand. The colour is not very bright. It can become more yellow, and the leaf is tiny. The leaves are picked twice a year, with a short break in between, and they don't grow very big. And here I have a different leaf, Hua Zhan. We usually call it Nongzhan. It takes more time to make it. About three days. The first kind needs two days. This leaf is much bigger and has a more vibrant green colour. It has a bright flavour and aroma. But it can have a bit of a rough taste. Locals prefer a much more delicate Qingzhan tea. It is a refined tea indeed. Usually people prefer tea with a brighter taste. You can feel the difference straight away. The more Tie Guan Yin you drink, the more you understand that King Shan has a unique and special note. Enjoy your tea. <laughs> 